This conference will now be recorded. Hello friends and once again welcome to BASPSolutions.com. My name is Amit and today I'm going to show you a very simple example of Groovy script and how to invoke the Groovy script within your planning environment, planning cloud environment. This is a tiny hello world example we will do to it today. So let's get started. So first you log into the planning application. In today's example, I'm using sales planning. Okay. And uh, I'm going to create a simple hello world example. So open your rule. And uh, in your rule, you have got an option to select calculation script or a business rule and Groovy script. You can use one of these options. So I'm going to right click and create one simple rule. New rule, name it. I'm going to give a name called Groovy script test one. And uh, here you can select the type of rule. I'm going to select Groovy script, script type as Groovy and type a simple print LN command. And within double quotes, you can put a string, hello world. That's it, after you create a script, save it, scan it, and you deploy it. You could have saved and, and uh, validate the script just by click on this option. And before you actually use the script, you're supposed to deploy it. So save is done, the validation is done, it passed. And there's an option for validate and deploy. Once the, script, once the script is deployed, you can see the script under system view or deployed. Under system view, you can see your script. Alternatively, you can see your script under deployment view. There you see what tools are to be deployed and what tools are already deployed. Under deploy script, you see today is 18th Groovy script test one. This is your script. It is deployed yet. Once your rule got deployed, you can invoke this rule directly. Option one, you can invoke rule, invoke this rule from here, launch. And once the rule got launched, you can see the output of this rule within your application. The rule ran successfully with no error. And you can see the output of this rule in your application, jobs, under jobs, you can see the business rule ran Groovy test one 13 seconds before. The rule ran and this is a simple example, hello world. Keeping this example, let's extend the simple example. I'm using variable. So you could also use this variable. You can use a variable and invoke this rule. You can associate this Groovy script with data form and upon certain event like on save, on load, uh, you can invoke this rule. So let me declare a variable called my name. And I'm going to assign this value of the variable is Amit. And in order to refer this variable, use dollar symbol and name of the variable. The system will recognize this is a variable, not a string. Save this, scan it, and deploy it. I'm going to validate and deploy in one go. Deployment done successfully. Now I'm going to invoke this rule. One way you can directly invoke from here, launch it. Alternatively, I'm going to invoke this rule from data form. So in this example, I've created a sample data form, a basic data form, and I want this rule to be invoked based on certain event. Okay. So for that, go to your data form. Form section. The sample data form I created, my team reporting. Go to edit. There's an option called business rule, and you have a list of business rules available. I'm going to remove other rules. Uh, Groovy test one. This is our rule. Select this rule, and one option you can explicitly invoke it, or alternatively, you can run this on event. Like, I want to run this rule. Run after save, run after save. So the moment you input numbers and hit the save button, this rule will be invoked, invoked automatically. Click on save and now let's test this. Finished. So this is my form. 
my team reporting this is my form and i'm going to input some number to this form right the moment i input number and hit the submit button you see the rule will be invoked so i'm going to invoke this rule from my data form application data i should have run this from data form my team reporting and i'm going to input some number here i'm going to invoke this rule the rule will be invoked automatically on save right because the event we have chosen on save when you click on save button the rule will be invoked the rule ran successfully right and the outcome you can see under your application log application job application job this is the rule ran 20 second before and under job status you can see the message hello world and the name of my variable called my name and the value of the variable my name is amit so this is just a tiny example which teaches you how to write a hello world example in groovy and invoke the same rule from planning environment data form thank you and should you have any question Please feel free to reach to us to bisbsolutions.com. Thank you.